Okay, so the Lord said he gave them one year to live your life, right? These people were jealous. These people were envious. These people wanted your place, okay? The Lord gave them one year. I spoke about that. I said one year to walk in your shoes because he wanted to test your, their hearts. And so many of these people failed, okay? The rug is being pulled from underneath their feet, these people thought that they were going to do all of this. I'm telling you, these are people that are hackers, okay? Some of these people are people that pay, put hits, wanted, envious, wanted your life. They wanted your, the way you look. They wanted your accent, right? They wanted your skin color. They wanted your hair color. They wanted your businesses. They did everything to be you. And this is what the Lord told me. The Lord said, okay, I'm giving them, I'm going to give them one year to just see if all of this they did, let, let me see if I can find a pure heart in them. And God said, they didn't even have a pure heart toward you. All of these things they stole, all of these things they did to you, the Lord could have gave that to them. God could have granted that same thing, some of these same things to them, but yet they did not have a pure heart. What's happening now is there's going to be a backfire. I'm telling you, it's going to be like Cinderella and those pumpkins for someone. When at 12 a.m., when the clock strike, she had to get out of that dress. For some people, they're going to have to get out of that spot. They're going to have to come out of that house. They're going to have to come out of that office. I'm telling you, they're going to have to move from messing with you. And see, this is the, this is the importance of not <coughs> being careful not to put yourself in a place where you're not supposed to go. Now we know this, the story of Cinderella. We understand that Cinderella had faith. We understand that her stepsisters and her stepmother was mean to her. We understand that. And I see that as a blessing, her being able to go to the ball. But still, and if you watch Cinderella 3, you saw how Cinderella was actually called to the princess. You saw how of uh, the prince, you saw how Cinderella was actually called to the castle. We saw how Cinderella was actually called to this. We saw how she worked for it. Some people, they just wanted to get it quick. I'm telling you. We saw in Cinderella 3 how she was actually destined for this particular life. These people wanted your life and now the clock didn't strike 12. Now the pumpkin busted apart and this is how many people and your enemies are going to look in this season busted apart because they're walking and trying to walk in things that God did not call them to. They're trying to walk in things that God said is yours. They're trying to walk in things that they're not 